The portion this week is Vayeshev, and it begins the long story from chapter 37 in Genesis until the end of the book in chapter 50 of Joseph and his brothers and their family and how they end up in Egypt. It's a beautiful narrative, a story with many twists of plot and a lot of issues with family dynamics. It's a story from which we can learn ourselves today how to relate to other people and we can derive lessons as to what can go wrong and what could go right in how we behave towards our siblings and towards our parents. And so the story could be read as a very personal story, just like any other story in literature. But because it's in the Torah, it serves also as a lesson for Jewish history because the characters of the story are supposed to represent Jewish Israelite history and the role that Jews have played in our story. And so the arrogance of Joseph and how he rises above his mistakes and learns from them is really a story about how Israelites were arrogant in their early history and should learn to rise above their mistakes as well. And so the story then of Vayeshev and the rest of the book of Genesis is not just about personal family life, it's about Jewish history. And if only we can learn all the time how to rise above our mistakes, we can learn that our lives can be much more fulfilled and much more meaningful. Shabbat Shalom.